Hey Isabel, I uh, just wanted to take some time today and read you a book and uh, I hope you enjoy this. We are going to be doing this from time to time. Hopefully I'm not the only one. I'm going to invite your Nina and your Nino and your aunts and uncles to all join me. Uh, but today I was really thinking about you and I wanted to read you a book by Dr. Seuss. It's called There's a Walk It in My Pocket. Now let me warn you, this book's a little crazy. Let's get right into it and enjoy some time together, okay? So there is a Walk It in My Pocket by Dr. Seuss. And it says, did you ever have the feeling there's a wasket in your basket? Or a Nero in your bureau? Or a wasset in your closet? Hmm. Sometimes I feel quite certain there's a jerkin in the curtain. Sometimes I have the feeling there's a zlock behind the clock. Hmm. And that zelf up on the shelf, I have talked to him myself. I don't know. That's the kind of house I live in. There's a nink in the sink, and a zamp in the lamp, and they're rather nice, I think. Some of them are very friendly, like the yacht that's in the pot, but that yachtle in the bottle. Some are friendly, some are not. Hmm. I like the zabel on the table, and the gear under the chair, but the bofa in the sofa, well, I wish he wasn't there. All the nubbards in the cupboards, they're good fun to have about, but that nooth gush on my toothbrush, him I could do without. The only one I'm really scared of is the vug under the rug. And the quimney up the chimney, I don't like him not at all, and uh, makes me kind of nervous when the zoll scoots down the hall. But the yeps on the steps, they're great fun to have around, and so are many, many other friends that I have found. Like the teller, and the neller, and the galler, and the deller, and the beller, and the weller, and the zeller, in the cellar. Hmm, that's a lot of them, right? And the geeling on the ceiling, and the zower in my shower, and the zillow on my pillow. I don't care if you believe it, that's the kind of house I live in, and I hope we never leave it. Well, I hope you enjoyed the book. That was quite a bit of fun, and uh... I hope I can read some more to you and, and that you'll have some fun enjoying it. So we'll talk to you later, sweetheart. Love you. Bye.